Hi, welcome to Lumberjack Cooking. I'm Sarah Casterton and today I'm going to prove to you that you can celebrate Taco Tuesdays with a few of your friends in the comfort of your own dorm. Now if you really want to make an impression on your friends, you're going to want to get fresh ingredients. Not only is that going to add so much flavor to your tacos, but it's going to be less expensive as well. So make sure to get the toppings of your choice. Okay, so here we have your basic taco toppings. We've got your cheese and your salsa. We've also got some fresh iceberg lettuce. Two kinds of peppers, red and green and a tomato. For a special topping to your tacos, we've got these avocados. We're going to use these to make a really simple guacamole. So after you wash your lettuce with cold water, make sure it's cold, otherwise it'll wilt. Pull out, peel off this outer layer. All right. Once you've done that, chop off your stem like so. Set it upright and cut it in half. Right. Okay, so now you want to cut your tomato into little dices. So start just like you did with the lettuce and cut off the stem. Then flip it over on your new base, cut it in half, take one of those halves and start cutting it horizontally into slivers. Finish chopping up your onions. And I actually kept this in the freezer before I started chopping this. If you do that, that's gonna prevent those tears. Okay, now let's chop up the peppers. Okay, now that you've got all your toppings, Chopped up and ready to go, we're gonna start on our guacamole. It's super easy. Be very careful when you're cutting your avocados though because there's a seed right in the middle. So you wanna make sure you're cutting right around that seed. Twist it open, revealing that seed. Now be very careful right here. All right, now just add a scoop of sour cream. All right, perfect. Now a secret I learned from my mom, because avocados can go bad so fast, is to take fresh squeezed lime juice. Put that on your guacamole, it'll keep it fresher so much longer. Now that we've got all our delicious toppings chopped up, ready to go, we're gonna start frying up the meat and warming up these tortillas. Fire up whatever choice of meat you want. You don't have to use ground beef. If you use ground turkey or ground chicken, that's gonna be a much leaner approach. Now for vegetarian alternatives, you can use ground veggie crumbles, rice with fake meat, and adding beans never hurts. Now while this is cooking, we're gonna go ahead and move over to our tortillas. All right, start by putting your burner on a low heat. Put some butter at the bottom of your pan. All right, now add your tortilla. Kind of swirl it around in here a little bit. Flip it over to the other side and just let that heat up a little bit. Don't overheat it or you're gonna get cracks in your tortillas. Okay, now we're gonna add some taco seasoning. What's great about this is it adds incredible flavor but it's still super cheap. All right, let's get this taco put together. Okay, there we go, there's our tacos.